Hey, good afternoon, more Medic One. Today I'm working on my little air compressor and I'm doing a little maintenance to it and I was gonna adjust the valves and I got to thinking, you know, what is the most common mistake most people make when adjusting the valves on a four cycle engine? Does a four cycle engine have? It has two. You have one on the compression stroke top dead center and you have one on the exhaust stroke top dead center. And what you want to do is you want to, when you adjust the valves, you want to get the piston at the top of its stroke on the, the uh, compression stroke. If you get the piston at top dead center on the wrong stroke and you adjust your valves, it's not gonna run very good. So let's go ahead and pull this piston up to top dead center on the compression stroke. Go a little more around, around, right here. And let's pull the valve cover and check the valve lash. piston is at the top dead center on the compression stroke then we know by looking at the valve lifters or the the rocker arms that we you know they've got slack and that's what you want however if you were to adjust these valves with the piston at top dead center on the exhaust stroke watch what happens let's roll the motor over around one time and that should be on the exhaust stroke all right top dead center on the exhaust stroke and as you can tell we are tight and this may give you know the inexperienced technician the thought that man these valves are just too tight well if you adjust the valves in this position the engine's going to run but it ain't going to run right because when it comes back around to the compression stroke the valve lash is going to be just too wide i'm just going to run through the basic four cycles of this engine you have your intake it's your carburetors here so this is going to be your intake valve and this will be your exhaust valve with your muffler so see if we can eyeball this piston and kind of watch down here on the rocker arms We're, right now we are on the intake stroke so the piston is going to go down and the intake valve will open drawing in the mixture. Now the piston's gonna start its way back up. That's going to be the compression stroke. Right about there is when the spark plug fires. The piston's going to go down. None of the valves should be moving. Piston's going down. And as the piston comes back up, the exhaust valve opens. And as the piston reaches the top, it's pushing the exhaust out through the muffler and then the cycle just repeats itself over and over and over and over until you wear it out. <laughs> Adjust your valves at top dead center on the compression stroke, maybe just a few degrees after the compression stroke to make sure you clear the compression release on an engine if it's got one like this one. But uh, other than that, you should be good to go. But if this helped you out, please give me a thumbs up and smash that like button. And the guys will see you on the next one. Have a great Thanksgiving. More Medic One.